Hey everyone, it's Amy, owner and curator of Yo So Boho. Um, oh gosh, there's a card out already. We're at Hartville Thrift Shop and we have a surprise visitor, guest, fellow YouTuber, Rochelle. Hi everyone! <laughs> from Deja Vu Thrift. She has come down from Ottawa, right? Yes, Ottawa, from Canada. Canada. Yeah. And she's gonna shop with us today. My Aunt Beth is here. She's already over checking out the latest cart. We just got here. They open at 10. I think it's about 10.10. 10. Um, and there's three carts already. So this should be a good shopping day. I hope so. I hope so too. Let's get to it. Yes. Is that a, that's not a long burger, is it? I, no. No, it's just a neat one. Is it on a slant? Yeah, yeah, I like that. That's pretty. Oh, very unusual. For a dollar. Yeah. I like that. Yeah, over here. All right, so Mary's here. She's got a loaded cart. Beth's already got a loaded <laughs> cart. It's literally what? Maybe 10.30? Mm -hmm. It's, yeah, we just saw another cart come in. So I'm being picky, of course. I have a few things I need to look up. This piece right here is a beautiful piece of pottery from Hillborn, which is a Canada studio. Look at that. It does have some issues and it's quite a big piece. And the Hillborn stuff is usually kind of thin. It's it's a good quality, um, but it's usually kind of thin. So I don't know if I want to ship that, but I'm definitely going to consider it for $3 and maybe send a photo to my sister because she would love it. This is a mystery. What do we think this is? It looks like it could hang on the wall. Would you hang something on it? This is the mystery of the day. I'm gonna try Google Lens. Um, I have a little, fun little basket here, just because it's made it easier to sort things. I do have, uh, oh, a couple of Wade's Whimsies down there. And these are fun, although I swore off any sort of napkin rings. These are really great. I'm gonna see who made these. They're all little fancy teapots. And then this, this is a mid-century bar kit, but look at the cool acrylic handles with the little chains in them. They have a really neat look. So yeah, we're gonna check those out. I'm gonna make a decision on those. I'm gonna Google lens that. I think that's it for now. Oh, this little mug here I'm deciding on. It's probably a made in Japan cute little owl. I'm such a sucker for owls. I'm seeing something here that looks like it might, yeah, that's a chip. So he'll probably stay behind. All right, we're checking out the seasonal room. <laughs> it's huge. It's actually made out of like real nature. <laughs> oh, our witch is gone that was here last week. I knew she would be. Look at her. She's pretty delightful. She got it. Her cape is a dish. We might have to look her up. She's very cool. And she looks to be in good condition. I know. Aren't they great? I think there's more of them. I saw like bigger ones and smaller ones. And look at that big one. It's a dollar. Somebody made them. Yeah, here's another one with little skeletons on it. But I want them all. I know, they're so cute. And the skeletons are mine. This guy is cute. Oh no, he's not enough skeletons. He's got enough, he's got enough. Look at that scaredy cat. Uh oh, they're moving carts out there. It always happens when I come in this room. Triggers a cart. Oh, I just peeked through here. Look at this little guy. <laughs> He's so fun. He's just kicking it. <laughs> She's cute too. She's that chippy ceramic. Oh, you're going to get some of those? Yeah. <laughs> and sell them like as a set. Yeah. yeah. It's down here. That looks like it could be a little older. Oh, look at him. 
He's fun. Kiss me, I'm fiendish. <gasps> Look at this guy over here. Is he a tin? Oh no, he's a teapot. He's got a big boo-boo right there. Oh my gosh, he's neat though. That's a shame. Look at this guy. He's like a really heavy resin. He's probably just a made in China. But he's a little trinket box. It's so cute. Super cute. Hmm. Thinking about him. Look at how happy this guy is. <laughs> He's on a big snowflake. He's fun. He's that really uh, lightweight resin. He just has a really cool look. I did pick up a little Santa with a cardinal on his hat. He's very sweet and he's got a candle. It's a brand new candle that's filled in there. I think he was sold at JCPenney's. Yeah, distributed by uh, JCPenney. So I think he's gonna come with us for two bucks. Also picked up this. I think this is on the last cart. It's a brand new, uh, very Bradley travel mug. I think they only had a dollar on it. So maybe we'll pick that up. I've made a decision. All of the hobbyist ceramics must be painted by whoever painted this one right here. Oh, MG. Look at how perfect this is with her little granny square Afghan. And look at her face and her eyelashes. Oh my gosh, it's so perfect. Oh, there's a little chippy and a chippy. We still might rescue this one. Oh my gosh, I have never seen such a well done piece. Those in the back? Yep. Oh, she's cute. And the little ice skater, yeah. she? She's fancy oh with a little hat. My. Yeah. This little snowman's missing a nose, but there's some cute stuff in there. How much I got on that? Three. Three. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Look at that huge pitcher. Jeez. There's a roly poly with uh, pink on it. Oh yeah. You wanna there peel it, it off? <laughs> I see a little piece of pottery back here. You don't need pottery. I don't. But it's got a bowling pin on it. Oh, wow. Well. Who doesn't need that? Who doesn't need pottery? Oh, here's a bread knife. These are nice. It's a nice primitive looking one. It's got its little sheath. Ooh, that one's oh, really she's good. cute. Ooh. That's what I was smelling. I knew it was smelling. It's it's smell that's smell my good. That's the kind of smell I like. And it's 30 cents, so. 30 cent candle, yeah, 30 cent that you candle. like the smell of? You can't beat that. Yeah, well, I remember that, uh, yeah. That's probably a, a bottle cleaner or something. Oh, that goes, it might be a replaceable top, like you have different ones to put on there. That's the scrubby, the scrubby company. Are you putting it back? Yeah. I might check it out. Usually if you see a woman with a Washington, it's Martha. Would she wear a little bun? Um, I would say George Washington, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, yeah, everybody's like, oh, here comes the cart. Oh, I see a little brass piglets. There's an old brown. Yeah. It's got a chip on the top. Is it? What is that? That's interesting. We like interesting. That looks old and interesting. Oh, is that a kit over there? 
there, the dimensions with the. Yeah. Oh yeah. I'm not gonna grab it because you have a weird hold on it. I don't want. <laughs> I don't want you to drop all of this, whatever this is. Oh, no. those are fish floats. Yeah, I know. They're really That's cute. That's fun. Eh? Yeah. Floats. Yeah, these bubbles float on the top, and the fish kind of swim underneath them. So you can do like a fish bowl without live fish. Oh, that's not, oh, yeah. That's perfect for my grandson. Yep. Well, off of that new cart, I pulled this very cool thing. <laughs> Beth says she thinks it's a scribe. What does a scribe do? These are so cool. They're actual wood screws. And this is got definitely got some age. It helps you to mark something. Oh, it's a tool some sort of tool. I don't know, I love it. Measure and mark. I love it. I think we're definitely gonna grab that for a dollar. And then look at this little plane. Either yep, or. it's the plane. <laughs> the plane. I love the little detail of the paint in there. It's definitely an older one and it looks like it was hand, like this is definitely like handmade. It's so small. It's, it's really neat. I think also for a dollar, we're gonna get that. Um, I pulled this little guy off. He's dirty, but he's super cool. Got a little guy there on the handle. I don't know, I'm debating that. I'm debating this little piece of pottery here that has the bowling pin on it. It's from the Fun Club. I think I'm getting this for the car. It's a dash tray. It's one that just kind of sticks to the dash and holds your stuff. So I think I'm gonna get that. I found a guitar holder, but that's gonna stay. These you can get for about 10 bucks and this one's three. So it doesn't make sense. I love this little mug. Here's the Wade's Winsies in there. The mug is from Russ. It's in such great condition that I think we're gonna go ahead and get that and it's 50 cents. Um, these I pulled out of the back. Oh, this I just found. This is a mug rack, and it's just a really great looking one. I think I'm gonna add it to the mug sale. This little piece of pottery here is just a handmade little base for a pot. And I need, I need that, I need one of those. I've been looking for that, so. So these are little corner racks that I have to decide on. One was better than the other, so I might just take one but they're like nice little plant stands, corner corner plant stands, and they fold out. I'm not gonna get them out of there. Oh, the pig came off the last cart, that little guy. He's adorable, going with us, solid brass. And this, I don't know if I showed this, but my gosh, look at the work on this. Somebody hand painted this, it's signed. Oh, they're so wonderful. They're so whimsical. I think it says maybe Kathy. 86. I think this is Kathy. Talented. Very talented. They've got such a cool look. Yeah, and then it's got little details around the basket down here. The lid lifts off and it's got a little liner in there. Oh, and look it. She's smart. She made it so you can display that. Wow. Yeah, that's definitely going with us. I think that's going to be it for me. Oh, I want to show them the top you found when we walked out. We were going to the book room and then we got distracted. But look at this. This big summer shirt with the mushrooms. How it cute is that? Snaps up the buttons up the back. I felt buttons on the back. Yep, buttons all the way yeah, up the back. Yeah, super cute. Super cute. Oh, Beth also found a studio pottery mug. Oh, it's so pretty. I love that big, big plate here. Are you invading my car? I am invading your car. <laughs> and I'm admiring this basket. Isn't that neat? Oh, it is. Absolutely gorgeous. All right, so we were coming out of the book room and a cart came out with toys on it, but for some reason, these were on top of it. They're a buck a piece. They're all matching. Look at that little face. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. The dress. Oh my gosh. Does she not look very, they do not look happy at all. I guess they couldn't hold a you smile. They couldn't hold a smile. No, that and then look at the face. dress here. Look at her headgear. Oh. I would say 20s. 
gosh. Yeah, we're grabbing those. They're too great. Here's our loot it's in the back of the Prius. And we are headed on down the road. I think we're going to go grab some lunch. And then we're going to go to the Akron Bins. We had our lunch and we are headed into the Goodwill Bins. Rochelle has never been to the bins, so this is going to be exciting. Her and my friend Mary are already in the door. We are going to go in here and have some fun and see if we can find any treasures that we can resell or add to our thrifted homes. We'll see you inside. I looked down in here and I saw this little piece. It's Tonala. And then I realized, actually I didn't realize, <laughs> Rochelle realized it's a little tiny frog. He's got a little chippy but I feel like we can fix that. Oh my gosh, how cute. Dreamer. I need more coffee than that to dream. Oh, these guys are cute. Are they damaged? I feel like they're worth a look at. They're fun. FTD. Wow, look at the apples. Got a missing leaf there. Ooh. Oh, darn. She's broken. These are Dansk underneath here. You're doing great, sweetie. This is their bistro line. They're not in great condition. But they're not bad. There's only three of them. Mm, I might look those up. This cool old suitcase. This is like metal. Oh, it weighs a ton. That is so neat. An old leather uh, handle. Oh, I like that. Is this a hobbyist piece? Yes. But they're pretty neat. Oh, I was worried that there was going to be chipping and stuff. You see the other one? They didn't pick the greatest colors either. They could have done a little bit better with. This one seems. This one's okay. Yeah. We might be able to save one. Couldn't they have, like, you know, made the the caps like red and pretty? You can use it for planters, and then they the chip kind of lazy. Metal. That's true. They would be cute planters. Yeah. All right, so I have a whole cart here that we're dealing with. Um, this came out in a bunch of pieces, but like the track's not there. But I'm gonna see what the popularity of this is and see if I can just lot my extra pieces. Maybe somebody wants to do like a, you know, in addition to their original set or they lost some. So maybe we can uh, check that out. This was my best find here. I'm kind of stoked about this. This is a old lamp. It's in wonderful condition. Beth, did you see this? When I grabbed it, it works. We tested it and it works. Yes. It has the light up in here, like in the top. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty excited about it. It's older. It's <laughs> older. Yep. So I picked these up. They're England. I thought they were, yeah, I thought they were Franciscan Rose. Um, it says made in England. I don't know, they're pretty. I got a set of four. Let's take a look at those. Oh. Feel them. Put them in your hand. Ah. <laughs> he's so cute. He's so stinking cute. And he's going crazy. My cat would love that. I know, he would be a good cat toy. He's so cute. I like hit him in the bin and he just started moving like crazy. Kind of scared me. So there's some things in here we're going to check out. This guy's not old. I've had some of these that are old, but this guy's new. So we may not keep him. That might be a good thing for Beth's booth. Oh, we're going to check this girl out. So Mary found her. She's probably a school project. 
Look at this. <laughs> I love her so much. I think probably somebody made her in their art class. I don't see a signature on her. But look at her. <laughs> She's so cute. Her bow is about to fall off. I saw that in the book. Like, like, oh, she's so sweet. Huge. Um, there's a couple of these games. They're called Robot Turtles. Game for little programmers. I'm going to look these up. I also found something like this that was in a separate kind of container down here. Found some little Valentine's things that I'm going to check out. Good, I think I'm going to go through and look some stuff up and then report back on what I'm getting. What are you getting? I'm not sure yet. Did you find a ship? My ship finally came in. <laughs> Virginia Beach ship, Virginia Beach. apparently. Ooh, what's that little She's lady? Plastic canvas. Oh my gosh, look at her wings, uh -huh. they're huge. Her hair needs some help. Yeah, she's cute though. Little tiny Polish. Oh, little Polish pottery picture. That's adorable. I love that. And we think this might be a target bird here. We gotta do a Google lookup. Piece of cobalt glass. Yeah. Is this a pie plate or is this like a con That's console like bowl? Oh, that's nice. What's the thing that says atomic in your needle case? Oh, that's fun. Yeah, I started look at the graphics on that. Picking up sewing oh, things. Look at that. Any of them. That is what fun. These no, these are um, old needle. Yeah. It's great, great graphics on that. She's got some uh, village things here, a bridge and a little gazebo. And then this thing here, this styrofoam box, the linen and things, um, different heights, votive holders. They're red, really pretty. Oh, and then I picked this up. Oh, here we go. Perfect. Aren't they pretty? They're all different heights. Yeah. Really nice. And then I picked up this. It's chippied, but it's English. It's got some worn, yeah, there and here, and onto the back where the mark is. Oh, yeah. But I like that about it. Yep. So, I'll try and do a look up on it. We'll see. Well, we have seen a few park turnovers and we've narrowed stuff down. This is what I'm going home with. First, I found this really cool tote bag. It's a life is good tote. And I have some stuff in here. Um, something for Earth. There's a Cavaliers thing in here for Earth. I'm grabbing the little Chicky because he's just too cute. There's some little Funko Pops in here. It looks like maybe this one and this one go together. So maybe I'll try and just sell them as a little lot. And then this is David Bowie. I recognized him. I was like, no way. The Labyrinth. I love that movie. So we're gonna save him. I don't know, maybe somebody will want him. I found some little ornaments. This one right here is a House of Hatton, which is a good name to look out for. I've bought ornaments from uh, House of Hatton before and they were worth good money. Uh, another nativity. This one is made in Italy. It's marked made in Italy. These are Fontanini. They are the plastic. Somebody glued them in there. They did a nice job. That'll sell, definitely. I am gonna try and list the linens and things glasses that we picked up this is the find of the day absolutely this lamp is gorgeous um, i found a little glass bird little ornament and this little set i think is going to be a good listing too this is attributed to this de paolo and i found other things i did not find them but i found other things that um, were listed pretty well these are disgusting. <laughs> they need cleaned, but they are little made in India lanterns and there's two of them. So I will list them together. They've got some age. They're gonna be a project to clean out. And then I got this trivet and it's freaking adorable. I'm going to stop putting things off starting tomorrow. Isn't that fun? That's it. Not a lot, but a really nice treasure right there. All right, while we're waiting in line here, we're gonna 
check out Rochelle's cart. She's got some glassings, some pretty little ornaments, and she's got lots of things for the grandkids. This by far is my favorite find. Santa is in there. He's, this is occupied, it says occupied. Somebody wrote poop on the back, but look. He's shaking the whole outhouse with his whatever, whatever is happening in there. It's hilarious. Hilarious. And then she said she looked it up and they're selling really well. So that's a cool find. And she got a costume. Yeah, is that what you're going to wear? No, no, although it probably would fit me. <laughs> but I like this here Yeah, that's a lot. nice too. That's very nice. A vamp calendar. Yeah. And then... You just kind of... It mag it's a magnet. magnet. Yeah, I know. Nice. So no pieces can be lost. Yeah, I like that. That's very clever. She said she's no longer a what? A Goodwill bin virgin. A Goodwill bin virgin. <laughs> we came, no we more. conquered. <laughs> yeah. So we're just walking back in because we're going to say goodbye to my friend Mary. I got to wash the hands. Mm -hmm. um, but we could do a quick outro if you would like. Sure. It has been the funnest day, yes, and absolutely. we're actually going to hang out tomorrow as well. Yes. So maybe we'll get some more content tomorrow. So but today around. was amazing. It I'm was so fun. glad you I, came. I love the experience following Amy around her neighborhood and uh, the Goodwill Bins. You hit I the best it. two places in my neighborhood. There you go. You hit the Hartville and you hit the Goodwill Bins. Thank you so, so much. <laughs> it was a blast. Yes, it was. All right, everybody. I will see you on the next one. Maybe. We'll be again yes. with you. Yeah. Until then, please take care.